welcome. I'm Salvatore Moroni. I know who you are. What do you want? Here's the thing. Jim, just tell the truth. <laughs> you want a drink, Jim? I'm having a Negroni. So good with seafood. Water. So our friend here told me a fascinating story. Never heard a story so good. It's hard to believe it's true. It is, it's true. Shut up! Shut up! One more word and I'll jam this down your throat. I try to be civil, Jim. But I'm not the kind of man that likes to ask twice. So here's how it's gonna go. Slow down, Mr. Maroney. I don't know you. No, no, no. You let me finish. You'll have your turn to speak. Okay, then. I want you to tell me the same exact story that Penguin told me. What story is that? Oh, you better know what story, my friend. Because if you tell me the same story he told me, then I could believe it's true. Then I'm happy. But if you tell me another story, oh, um, then someone's lying to me. And I don't know which one, and the both of you will die. Understand? Yes, I do. Good. So, tell me a story, Jim. Somebody murdered Thomas and Martha Wayne. My partner and I caught the case. We didn't even know each other What then. did I say? Go put them on the slicer. No, no, no. no. <laughs> I don't like what I hear. Slice his face, Pajut. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Go on. I was a pawn in a conspiracy between Falcon, the mayor, and the GCPD to frame Mario Pepper for the Wayne murders with the help of Fish Mooney, Mr. Cobblepot's employer at the time. Mr. Cobblepot then told the whole story to the MCU to prove that I wouldn't betray the conspiracy, Falcon ordered me to kill Cobblepot. I didn't do it. I let him live. And here we are. Falcone, Mooney, the MCU cops. None of them know he's alive. If they did, I'd be dead already. <laughs> it's delicious. <laughs> Frankie! Bring the penguin back out here. The little punk is telling the truth. Thank you, Jim. Good story. Told well. A lot of guys in your situation, they freak out. There you are, you rat, you snitch, you gorgeous turncoat son of a bitch. Come here, I love you. Mwah! Be happy, Frankie. We just got a brand new weapon against the Falcons. It's Christmas. Happy holidays. Can I go now? Oh, yeah, Jim, you can go. You know, just so that we uh, understand each other. I'll keep all this hush-hush between us pals. And if I need you again, I'll call you. You do that. Get you, come on. Let's get you cleaned up. Look at you, come on. <laughs>